Oh yeah, what is up everybody? It's your boy Onto the Boss here and uh, I was getting ready to say welcome to a Madden Ultimate Team video But I completely forgot this is NCAA Football 14 Yes, I said it So let's go ahead and start off my Ultimate Team career Now before you go ahead and start things off This is really similar to Madden You basically, instead of having to pick a captain for your team You basically have to pick a team to start out with Now, I decided to go ahead and pick my hometown team The Maryland Turpins And because of the fact that I picked them I get their default uniforms and also their playbook. So, one of the first things that you're going to get is this free starter pack. And, uh, obviously, the point of this is to get your team going. And these are going to be some uh, doo-doo players. I got to tell you that because you're going to get around 60 to 70 overall player. And look who we start out with. Mark Sanchez, his freshman year card. We got Christian Ponder, D'Angelo Williams. And uh, for those that are unfamiliar with this, obviously, these are all former NFL players you guys are not going to be seeing any current college football players so that is why you see all these former uh not former uh NFL players I meant to say former college players so you got Brandon Albert right here you guys saw me getting Ted Ginn and uh we keep going down the list uh most of these players I don't know I've never heard of these guys Andre Branch I've heard of him uh this guy right here nope Gerald McCoy that's a pretty nice card but since he's a freshman uh the cards overall is really low and I mean basically most of these cards that you guys are seeing on your screen is pretty low so uh, Vontae Davis right there Will Hill Brandon Taylor and there goes my special teams you got the kicker Mike Nugget and you also get the punter and a couple more cornerbacks right here then we get a I don't know why a second string kicker B Blair Walsh and then here is a Maryland player, Will. And then Felix Jones. Okay, that's his freshman year for Arkansas. MNT Bank Stadium. And then you guys see the offensive and defensive playbooks right here for the Maryland Terrapins. And Dan Gronkowski. Is this uh, Gronk's cousin or something? I don't even know. And we get Adrian Moulton on that. And then we get finally the uniforms for the Maryland Terrapins. Now, last but not least, when I came back after that pack opening, it said that I have two items. Now, this is something that I'm pretty sure everybody gets. The Barry Sanders 80 overall freshman year card. And then you also get the Bo Jackson freshman year card. So this is probably going to be one of your best players on your team to start out with so i'm pretty excited you guys can see the back of the card the stats on it it's just outstanding compared to the cards that you get in the starter pack so before i go ahead and uh play a game i noticed that i had one on open pack and this is basically an all american pack and if you guys are not sure what an all american pack is it is pretty much equivalent to a legendary pack that you get in uh, Madden so here we go right off the bat we get a guard 82 overall Josh right here Patrick Willis oh my goodness 91 overall middle linebacker so he's so far the best player that is going to be on my team so that's a pretty nice card right there Chris Hawkins 67 corner and we get a BYU uh, playbook right there uniform Keenan Clayton 75 overall linebacker Old Mississippi Stadium and uh let's see what else and that is pretty much it so we get a couple of contract extension extensions at all so that is not a bad pack at all and like i said again that is going to be the all-american pack now before we go ahead and start anything off uh, i just want to show you guys my offense and defense how my lineup is looking and uh this is definitely going to be a journey because obviously when you first start out ultimate team your team is going to be pretty much garbage although there's a lot of high you know names out there high quality names uh i know i know as soon as i said high quality name mark sanchez's name came up there's a high a lot of high quality names but most of these cards are their freshman year cards so that's why a lot of these players are not rated so well but this guy right here beast of a card 99 or 91 overall should i say uh patrick willis so here goes my defensive secondary and that is pretty much all i'm going to be showing you guys but last but not least I wanted you guys to take a look at, you know, the auction or actually the store first, then we'll look at the auction. Now, the reason why I want to show you guys the store is because some of these cards you cannot buy with coins and that is kind of disappointing to me. So, you guys see the gold starter team upgrade, that is with coins, varsity pack, that is with coins as well, Microsoft and actual uh, ultimate team coins and the beginner pack is uh, strictly just uh, team points. Now, when you go ahead and try to do packs, for example, bundles, that is when things get a little tricky. So we go ahead and check out a veteran pack. Obviously, for those single packs, you can actually buy them with coins, ultimate team coins. But when you try to buy actual bundles, more than one pack, 
you can't get those with coins. So that is the only disappointing thing because a lot of us, you know, purchase things in bundles. We don't want to just order things with just a single pack by itself. So if you guys are thinking about buying these actual bundles, for example, a lot of packs into one, then most of them are going to be with actual Microsoft points instead of ultimate team coins so that is the only thing the only downside that i've noticed so far and uh last but not least since i'm one of the few people that are logged in right now and uh let's take a look at what players they have up right now in the auction i don't really think there's a lot so let's go ahead and filter it to 95 to 99 overall quarterbacks and uh let's just see what they have on the auction and like you guys see here there's only one card up right now this is the peyton manning 95 overall reward edition card it's a pretty nice card but you see it's 10,000 coins so without further ado i think i'm set to go you guys see some of the overview some of the you know basics of ultimate team and on so late now to go ahead and play online you have to do this head-to-head -head season mode and obviously i'm still at level one I think there's a pretty cool thing right here. So let's go ahead and click on this and see how many games I have. So you guys see it's 10 games and then you start playoffs, round one, quarterfinals, semifinals, and then you go ahead and play the championship game. Now, here we go. I'm going to go ahead and try to play my first game. It is searching for an opponent and you guys can see my opponent is not going to be on the same level, but let's go ahead and get this one started. So you guys see he's going to be receiving a ball first. And uh, let's go ahead and get this kick off and start the... Uh-oh, uh I thought my game was about to freeze right there. But here we go, people. The game is kicked off, and he's going to take this one with David Emerson, a current Redskins player, and he's going to take this one to the house. But I am right there with the stop, so that is not a good way to start off the game for us. Here comes Bo Jackson on the other way. He gets taken down. One yard right shot there. That could have been a lot more than that. So here he comes, just cutting through the hole as he picks up eight more yards right there. So it's third and one now. All he has to do is give it back to Bo Jackson. And this guy, I mean, beast of a card. You see his talent right now in front of your screen. And not only was he doing it on the rushing end, he also, you know, his first pass of the game was completed to Salas right there. So a completion right there for first down. Then he's going to tap this one in for an eight yard touchdown. Bo Jackson kicking off his career in ultimate team on a good start right here. I'm going to come back with my Bo Jackson. That sounds kind of wrong, but you guys know what I'm trying to say here. Bo Jackson gets eight yards on the play and a second and full right here. I'm going to get a completion of Cunningham and Cunningham is going to break this tackle. And we are finally after that 24 yard uh, reception into his own territory. So I'm going to be stepping back right here after a deficit, you know, uh, that we have to overcome now. Second and 18, Mark Sanchez goes down for back to back sacks. But luckily, no one was on the right side of the field on this screenplay. A good call by the offensive coordinator. I got to give it to them. So second and 10 now. One minute remaining in the second quarter. Cunningham once again, but this time he gets popped on the play. And the struggles for Mark Sanchez continues right here. And look at them. Are you kidding me? Fourth down. He can't even get the pass off, but I decided to go for it right here on fourth down. We got to play risky. A lot of risk, but no reward on that play. You guys saw the accuracy on Mark Sanchez. That is not going to get the job done. So my opponent comes out here once again, and you see the matchup difference. He had, I'm not going to lie, a lot of good talent on his team, and that is why he was just, you know, running around my defense. So back-to-back -back completions, then all he has to do is give it to Bo Jackson here, who's literally not going to go down on any play so I'm already down by two touchdowns and starting off the second half that is possibly the worst thing that I could do and yes no one is going to catch up to him as he gets his third touchdown so I got a little frustrated and I wanted to take a look at his team you guys see you know it's not crazy but for how you know the amount of time this game has been out and since this is my first ever game you guys can see offensively he's pretty stacked compared to my team and i didn't even check out his defense but you guys can get my drift right here but you know there's no such thing as giving up so i'm gonna keep on driving right here mark sanchez a completion right there and he's gonna give it a jackson look at jackson ah but he gets taken out right here for only six yard of pickup and then we're going to go back right to him. Oh, my goodness. You see him cutting, and no one is able. Uh-oh, uh-oh, there's one guy ahead of me, and he is able to get me down. So the juke move did not work out to perfection. First and goal right here. We're going to try to do a hurdle over the defense. And Bo Jackson for us 
gets us the first touchdown of the game. So it's 21 to 7 right here. And uh, with a minute remaining, you guys can tell we need a stop. And that is the, you know, the last thing that we got. He gets back to back first downs. He's just out here just killing the clock. And finally, I caught a break right here. You see Harris gets an interception. Well, Harris, you know, he's been doing a pretty good, you know, uh, performance so far in this game. But I decided to come out here with 10 seconds remaining. Obviously, this is desperation. The game is basically over. But we're still going to try and, you know, make the deficit a little smaller as Mark Chan Sanchez goes deep on the play here and that one gets intercepted so that tells you a lot about the game that I had with Mark Sanchez so we came out here we we're a little outmatched and we pick up our first loss in ultimate team but like I said it is going to be a prog progress as we make our team a little better it's your boy onto the boss I'll see you guys next time I'm out if you guys want to stay updated on when all my videos will be uploaded make sure you follow me on twitter twitter.com slash onto the boss